प्रिंसिपल ऑफ प्रायोरिटी एंड इट्स लिमिटेशंस नाउ कमिंग टू द प्रिंसिपल ऑफ प्रायोरिटी ईच टैक्सोनॉमिक ग्रुप विद अ पर्टिकुलर सर्कमस्क्रिप्शन पोजिशन एंड रूट कैन बेयर ओनली वन करेक्ट नेम द अर्लीस्ट दैट इज इन अकॉर्डेंस विद द रूल्स एक्सेप्ट इन स्पेसिफिक केसेस प्रिंसिपल ऑफ प्रायोरिटी इज कंसर्न विद द सेलेक्शन ऑफ अ सिंगल करेक्ट नेम ऑफ टैक्सोनॉमिक ग्रुप ओनली लेजिटिमेट नेम्स शुड बी रिटेन्ड वाइल द इलेजिटिमेट नेम्स शुड बी रिजेक्टेड अकॉर्डिंग टू आर्टिकल इलेवन ट्वेल्व रूल्स फॉर प्रायोरिटी आर ईच फैमिली और टैक्सॉन ऑफ लोअर रैंक विद अ पर्टिक्युलर सर्कमस्क्रिप्शन पोजिशन एंड रैंक कैन बेयर ओनली वन करेक्ट नेम फॉर एनी टैक्सॉन फ्रॉम फैमिली टू जीनस इंक्लूसिव द करेक्ट नेम इज द अर्लीस्ट लेजिटिमेट वन वैलिडली पब्लिश विद द सेम रैंक a name of a taxon has no status under this code unless it is validly published application of both conserved and rejected names is determined by nomenclatural type when a name proposed for conservation has been provisionally approved by the general committee botanists are authorized to retain it pending the decision of a later international botanical congress principle of priority is not implemented on higher taxa above the rank of family valid publication of names is usually considered beginning in may 1753 The date of publication of Species Plantarum Book, Volume One, by Linnaeus. With many names of a taxon, the valid will be the earliest name which is regarded as correct name. Rule of priority provides stability to this name. The principle that seniority is fixed by the date of valid publication. is known as principle of priority for example nymphaea nauchali nymphaea stellata nymphaea acutiloba nymphaea taurus are names of the same species but if rule of priority is applied the first name is correct name which was published in 1768 that is the earliest one so that is the correct name and the other three are synonyms example 2 is a north american wild flower genus agallinus which was published in 1837 but for a long time it was included in the ambiguously named genus gerardia In 1961 the problem with the name Gerardia was resolved and Agallinus came into common use however three relatively unknown names for the genus had been published earlier Vergularia Chytria and Tomenthera of which Vergularia would have priority since it was published earlier these three names have since been rejected in favor of Agallinus Example three is that of Fiscium natans. Laurero described a plant and named it Fiscium natans in 1790. Jassieu transferred it in genus Vallisneria in 1828. He instead of natans gave the name specific name as Vallisneria fiscium. It is a superfluous name. Grebner described the same plant as Vallisneria gigantea in 1912 and Mickey in 1934 named it as Vallisneria asiatica. Hara while studying asiatic species confirmed that all these names are synonyms. 
there is no legitimate combination based on fiscium natans so he made valisneria natans hara in 1974 the correct name of the specimen is now the recent name but it is based on earliest basionym others will be synonyms fiscium natans and valisneria fiscium will be known as nomenclatural synonyms or homotypic synonyms valisneria gigantia and valisneria asiatica are the names based on separate types such synonyms are known as taxonomic synonyms or heterotypic synonyms now coming to the limitations of principles of priority firstly the starting dates principles of priority starts with the species plantarum of linnaeus published in published on 1st may 1753 the starting dates for different groups are provided the publications therefore before these dates for respective groups are ignored while deciding the priority then the next limitation is it is limited only up to family ranks this principle does not apply over family rank so it is limited only up to family ranks the third limitation is the corrected name should not be outside the rank only when a correct name in the taxon is not available can a combination be made using the epithet from another rank next is the application of principles of priority resulted in numerous name changes to avoid it a list of conserved generic and family names have been prepared a list has been prepared and published in the code with some changes such are nomina conservanda nomina conservandum is a latin term meaning a name to be conserved the name is retained even though it violates one or more rules which would otherwise prevent it from being legitimate such nomina conservanda are to be used as correct name replacing earlier legitimate name conservation of names of species according to the rules of nomenclature when two species with the same date of publication are united the author who unites them first has the choice of selecting the correct binomial in spite of several protests from agricultural botanists and horticulturists who were disgusted with frequent name changes due to the strict application of the principle of priority taxonomists for a long period did not agree upon conserving names at the species level the mounting pressure and the discovery that triticum estivum was not the correct name of common wheat compelled taxonomists to agree at the sydney congress in 1981 upon the provision to conserve names of species of major economic importance as a result triticum estivum was the first species name conserved at berlin congress in 1987 and published in subsequent code in 1988 another species name also conserved along with was lycopersicon esculentum name of hybrids hybridity is indicated by the use of the multiplication sign or by the addition of prefix notho to the term denoting the rank of the taxon the principal ranks being notho genus and notho species a hybrid between named taxa may be indicated by placing the multiplication sign between the names of the taxa the whole expression is then called a hybrid formula agrostis into polypogon agrostis stolonifera into polypogon 
monspeliensis. Salix aurita into Salix capria. It is usually preferable to place the names or epithets in a formula in alphabetical order. If a non-alphabetical sequence is used, its basis should be clearly indicated. A hybrid may either be interspecific between two species belonging to the same genus or intergeneric between two species belonging to two different genera. A binary name may be given to the interspecific hybrid or noto species by placing the cross sign before the specific epithet as in the following cases. Salix into Capriola. Rosa into Odorata, etc. The variants of interspecific hybrids are named Noto subspecies and Noto varieties. Example, Salix rubens Noto variety, Basfordiana. For an intergeneric hybrid, if a given distinct generic name, the name is formed as a condensed formula by using the first part or whole of one parental genus and last part or whole of another genus but not the whole of both genera. Example, triticocicale from triticum and cicale. The nothogeneric name of an intergeneric hybrid derived from four or more genera is formed from the name of a person to which is added the termination ara, a -R -A. No such name may exceed eight syllables such a name is regarded as a condensed formula. Into Potinara. Names of cultivated plants. The names of cultivated plants are governed by the International Code of Nomenclature for Cultivated Plants, ICNCP, last published in 1995. Most of the rules are taken from ICBN with additional recognition of a rank cultivar, abbreviated CV for cultivated varieties. The name of a cultivar is not written in italics, it starts with a capital letter and is not a Latin, but rather a common name. It is either preceded by CV, as in Rosa Floribunda CV, or simply within single quotation marks, as Rosa Floribunda. Cultivars may also be named directly under a genus, under a hybrid, or directly under a common name. Since 1st January 1959, new cultivar names should have a description published in any language and these names must not be the same as the botanical or common name of a genus or a species. Thus, cultivar names, rose, onion, etc. are not permitted as the name of a cultivar. It is recommended that cultivar names be registered with proper registering authorities to prevent duplication or misuse of cultivar names. Registering authorities exist separately for roses, orchids and several other groups or genera.